Welcome back to Free Speech TV's Newswire. I'm Jared Jakang Mayer. The tag Made in China is ubiquitous on everything from t-shirts to furniture. But now it turns out that major portions of America's infrastructure are being outsourced to China, meaning that many U.S. construction workers stay unemployed. Chinese companies now have contracts to provide material for projects ranging from new bridges to train platforms. And last week, a federal judge, a federal court overturned a Michigan law banning the use of affirmative action at colleges and universities. A 2006 voter initiative prohibited higher ed schools from considering race and ethnicity. Yeah, I can't screen that. Okay. Federal court. Federal court. Welcome back to Free Speech TV's Newswire. I'm Jared Jakang Mayer. The tag Made in China is ubiquitous on everything from t-shirts to furniture. But now it turns out that major portions of America's infrastructure are being outsourced to China, meaning that many U.S. construction workers stay unemployed. Chinese companies now have contracts to provide material for projects ranging from new bridges to train platforms. Last week, a federal court overturned a Michigan law banning the use of affirmative action at colleges and universities. A 2006 voter initiative prohibited higher ed schools from considering race and ethnicity in admissions. The case is expected to face appeal before the U.S. Supreme Court. Same-sex couples in New York started applying for marriage licenses online just 11 days after gay marriage was legalized. Ayes 33, nays 29. <laughs> For many same-sex couples in New York City, the next step towards marriage is just a few clicks away. Gay and lesbian couples in New York started filing their applications for marriage licenses on the city clerk's website on Tuesday. Filing for a marriage license is one of the steps towards marriage. Couples are still expected to appear in person to finalize the process and collect their licenses. Same-sex marriage licenses won't be issued until July 25th, 30 days after the state legislators legalized gay marriage. Many same-sex marriage events are already planned for the day after licenses start getting issued. A report by the Independent Democratic Conference estimates that more than 21,000 gay and lesbian couples in New York will get married within the next three years. New York has become the sixth and most populous state in the nation to legalize gay marriage. This is Marcy Miranda for Newswire. <laughs> 